it's always nice to stop and enjoy the view. Beautiful sunset and you can see a painting in the sky and plenty of people enjoyed the moment there during magic hour and sunset tracker. As we take a closer look, the days are actually getting shorter and shorter week by week. 655 today, two weeks from today, 642 and then notice about three weeks from today, 636. So we will be seeing shorter days and also still very warm afternoon highs for now. As we head into September, things will cool down slightly. But for now, we're talking about the upper 80s into the low 90s and then a slow cool down into the evening hours. 82 degrees, though, in Hilo is what it feels like. Jump over to Kailua Kona, much warmer. It feels like 88 degrees. And Hilo actually tracking more showers into the night. We have been seeing some wet roadways out there. 79 degrees. And then notice a probably 60 to 70 percent chance of showers will be in the red past midnight. So slick roadways into the morning hours and then leeward Maui 80 degrees for now and the coolest time of the night after that four o'clock five o'clock hour will get to about 74 degrees and plenty of stars, not a whole lot of rain and just limited rain over the mountains. That's exactly what we're seeing on the radar, but we're starting to see more showers pick up over leeward neighborhoods, at least for the far west western end of the state as we're seeing low line moisture come into the picture hitching a ride on those trade winds a little bit more busy on the radar as we take a closer look there you can see it stacked up against the Kuala Mountains some heavy pockets in fact about a half an inch per hour and then some of those light showers trickling in along the H1 the West Maui Mountains we're seeing just a couple over Kihei and then you can see it the road to Hana, a little bit slick here and there, and volcano seeing a little action. And then going all the way to the Garden Isle, we're seeing a few showers into the morning hours. So steady trade winds anywhere from 10 to 25 miles per hour. Here's a quick look at surf. It's leveling out, nothing too big. And we will be seeing into the next seven days those trade winds taking us into the weekend and beyond. All right, thanks a lot, Jen. Well, new tonight, the L.A. Clippers and Utah Jazz plan to donate all proceeds from a Hawaii preseason game to benefit the wildfire relief in Lahaina. The Clippers are returning to Hawaii in early October for their training camp at UH Manoa Stan Sheriff Center. The Clippers will also play the Utah Jazz in an October 8th exhibition game. The Clippers Hawaii Classic tips off at 3 p.m. All proceeds will go to the Hawaii Community Foundation's Maui Strong Fund. The food that we grow is, is going to people in Hawaii. It's feeding our community. Coming up, how the food bank is getting fresh and locally grown. 